Hi everyone. Right, I'm going to show you how to make this. It's a little butterfly um, and it's made from uh, organza ribbon. And you need about, well, depending on the size of the butterfly, it's only made from two pieces. Um, so this is about one point, one and a quarter inch wide. But if you wanted to, you could make the big, in fact, I'll make the bigger one uh, because then you'll be able to see it a little bit better. So I'm just going to cut the two inch wide white um, ribbon. And I'm going to do that. You need two pieces. Let's see. Don't know how long I did that one. I can't remember. Well, that's about 12, about 14 inches long. Okay, so let's do it a little bit longer, like that. And we'll just double that. I'm only roughly guessing this at the moment. There we go. So we've got our two pieces there. Now what we need to do is to seal off the ends. Just run the flame down we do sell these in the store uh, store we are waiting on the other ones to come in um because at the moment they've uh, sold we've sold out and the warehouse has as well so i'm just waiting for them to get them back in but that's all you need to do so you're going to need two strips of organza ribbon for anything from an inch to i would really you need to do an inch and a half to two inch wide this is two inch wide um some bling just for the antennae, some um, pearls or whatever you want to put down the centre. I'm going to use that. I think I'm going to use that, but I might use something else. A little bit of wire, which I shall now get hold of. Um, there's my scissors. Shouldn't have cut it with the scissors, but there you go. I'll use that piece. There you go. Another bit of um, string, I was going to call it, another bit of lace that's going to run down the middle and we're going to gather that. A colouring, because you're going to colour the uh, lace. I've got this two-tone here. And a needle and thread. So what I'm going to do now is just sew the first strip. And the needle. And I'm not going to colour it until I've actually put it on. You know, till we've made the butterfly.
There we go. So we're just going to pull that together. And then what we have to do is just spread that out. So we start pulling it from there and evening that out. Yeah, a little bit more. And I'm just going to seal this off. Like that. That should be fine. Yeah, we've got two about the same. Okay, so just put my needle out of the way because I always end up losing them. Now all I'm going to do is just glue the two centres together. And that's all you do and then hold that. Just glue them together. And you can fluff about with this. Oops. Almost there. You can just, if it tucks out a little bit, tuck it back in. I mean, if it pulls out a little bit, just tuck it back in there. That's fine. That's great. Okay, so we've got that. So here's our butterfly. Now what we need to do is again, it's gone. It's gone flying. <laughs> Come back here. You need your uh, needle and thread again. In a minute. First of all, we've just got to do this section now. I'm going to gather this little bit up. I'm using this one because it's got a nice space between. So I'm just doing a tacking stitch just to hold that. And then we'll go like that. See how it's a nice space between each one. So the gather will be nicely spaced out. There we go. And then what I'm going to do, I'm not having it as gathered as that one because this is a bit bigger butterfly. I think that will do. We pop that onto there and sew that in. Now you can sew it because you've got glue here. You, you can't really sew much on that. But just do it on the end if you can. Do the left side, then the right side. So you're attaching this to this. And then this to this. Like that. That's fine. One more tack. And we snip that off. Now. Then we, we've got this and we can move it about. And put the gather where we want it. Like that. Not your thread. And then we're just going to find the centre of this one and tack this one in place. Okay. Snip that off. Like that. Now, I could have glued it in. I'm going to glue the centre in now. Oh, sorry, I need to tack that off. I'm going to glue the centre in now, but I could have just glued it all on anyway, but I didn't want to do that. It's uh, firmly held with a little bit of a tacking stitch. Okay, so now what we do is we lift that up and down the centre we glue. And then what we do is we're going to manoeuvre this about so we get exactly what we want and where we want it to go like that and this can be as gathered wherever you want it as you like it if that makes sense there we go 
then I take the trim. Now I'm going to put a little bit of pearl trim down that one, I think. Let me just get a bit of flat trim. Yeah, I think I'm going to put the pearl. Well, that's much better. Down the centre there. And snip that off. That lovely. And I'm going to just just a dob of glue and glue them two bits down a bit like that just to pull them in okay so then what we need take the needle and you start not halfway but a quarter of the way or just just a little bit more than a quarter of the way and you do a little tacking stitch here so make sure you've caught everything because it is frilly remember and then you just in between the gaps open the gap up and you do a couple of running stitches go through the back right out the other side and you can carry on going so you can Get the right place. Is that enough? Yeah, I think so. Right, and then you pull. Just pull that in and you push that in. And while that's pushed in, then you do a tacking stitch. My needles come off. Let me just cut that. Yeah, just do your little tacking stitch, which holds that in. And cut that off. So you don't need to do four pieces, you just need to do the three, uh, the, sorry, the two. And you end up, whoops, I've dropped it now. <laughs> Sorry about that. And you end up with a beautiful butterfly. But we haven't finished because now what I'm going to do is just colour some of the areas that I want to colour. Um, and I'm going to do the edges. And you just paint it on, brush it on with your pen. Right. like that pull this back like I say you could have done this first but I just I like to see how far I need it like that because you might not do it enough and you have to do it again anyway so I'd rather do the, the central piece first the ribbon uh, and then color it afterwards that's it. And because you're doing the edges, it just gives it a beautiful, beautiful look. There you go. Bring this out here a bit. The colour. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at that. My favourite colour, of course. Take your wire. Now, I'm going to cut mine down a little bit, I think. I should use your pliers. Don't do what I do. Turn over the end, which is one, like that. Like that. Take it in the middle and bend it back. And this should be roughly 
the same. You can always manipulate that back so they're the same. And then what I do, I pinch them there and then I glue that section. And I'm going to have that as the top. So leave that on there. I take a little bit of um, felt. Just round it off a little bit. Like I say, it doesn't have to be perfect. Oh, my needle. See, I'm going to end up losing that. Um, take the glue round the edge. And then pop that on the back, which will secure the antennae. Right, we can move these. Just clear yourself of any glue strands. There you go. Uh, where did I put... Oh, there they are. Oh, <laughs> silly old. See how I've put the antennae, the little bling on there. So I've just got some here. I can get the glue off my thumb. Put those in a little bit. Just grab this and poke it in a little bit. It's too big. Like that. Pop a little bit of glue on that. And then on that one. As soon as they're dry, you can then sort out the strands. And we can pull them apart a little bit. But there you go. <coughs> Excuse me, gorgeous little butterflies. Ribbon butterflies. Are they stunning? And, um, you know, you make them as fluffy as you want. You could have brought, you know, bring them up a little bit more, but I think they're quite pretty. Um, and I hope that's helped you. Thanks for watching. Take care and I'll speak to you soon. Bye bye for now.